Hey everyone, Ferris Technology here, reviewing the new Canon PowerShot Elf 300 HS. It's uh, one of the smallest, most powerful point and shoot cameras you can get on the market right now. Um, first, I'll put the camera down there aside, and I'm just going to show you what's included in the box. So, um, this is your Canon standard type box um, that you have. Um, pretty straightforward box. I mean, it tells you everything that's inside of it. Don't, doesn't really matter. I'll show you exactly what's inside. Uh, these are the main things inside of it. So you've got your AV cables, which personally I never really use on the cameras nowadays. Um, me, I mean, because it is HDMI now. Um, this is your little uh, USB cable. Again, I have a memory card slot in my computer, so I don't really use that either. Um, as well as their CD-ROM for your installation and there's probably like their own little editing software and instruction guide so if you're an avid camera person um, all of these things you probably won't even use um, just keep those in the box until you want to actually maybe sell the camera or whatnot uh, physical aspects of the f of the actual camera itself um, just go over size I've got an iPhone 4 right here and uh, that uh, gives you kind of a perspective on the actual size I'm sorry about the fingerprints on my iPhone there, but uh, it's quite a quite a small camera, um, very thin. I mean, obviously not as thin as an iPhone, but uh, very nice camera. Um, it's got a 2.7 inch um, screen on the back. Um, one thing I would have liked to see on it would be a full 3 inch one, like the Elf uh, 100, but uh, that's okay. Um, another thing, uh, we'll go over physical aspects of it is uh, batteries right in there that obviously comes with it um, memory card slots right beside it so you just click that that's your memory card in there I'm using a 16 gigabyte memory card um, I would recommend a little bit higher quality memory card for the 1080p HD movie shooting um, definitely worth it um, you want to have a little bit faster of a card um, uh, there we go so buttons on the back um, lens flash obviously um, one thing I'll point out about this camera which I'll show you is when you turn it on it's very very quick to turn on which I really like um, just because when you want to get those pictures and whatnot you really want to have your camera turn on really fast so I really really like that about this camera uh, five mega uh, it's a uh, five times optical zoom which is really nice you don't really get that on most point and shoots as well as a uh, five time optical zoom during uh, your 1080p video shooting. So it's 1080p at uh, 24 frames um, per minute, or per second, sorry, uh, per minute would be a lot. Um, basically, um, one thing that to note though as well is when you're in video mode, um, it's got this one touch button right here for the video mode. Um, so when you click, click that, it immediately takes you to video. Um, and I'll show you the zooming uh, during uh, here, I'll try and get it so you guys can see here, but the zooming is very slow and it does take a little bit to focus as well. I know you can't really see here, but it does take a little bit to focus the video, but the video quality is excellent. Um, I'm going to cut right now right to a video that I took of a car um, with this camera, so we'll cut right now. So there you go, so that's the video from it. As you can see, it's excellent quality uh, for the 1080p video. Um, great picture and everything. So um, obviously for taking pictures, it's very good. Um, it's got really nice zoom. Um, for just your regular point and shoot camera when you want to take out um, to a party or something like that, a lot of people, it takes excellent, excellent quality pictures. Um, another cool, really cool feature of it um, that you can do with it is um, it's got what's called night mode. And night mode is uh, basically you take a um, go into your settings onto it on your menu, and you can actually ch uh, change it onto night mode, and you it'll automatically basically take three pictures um, at night in three different uh, like lighting settings, and it'll combine them all together to equal um, your picture that you want. So um, that's a really cool feature of it. Um, really, really like that feature. 
It's got all kinds of other features as well, self timer. Um, for video you can change the quality of the video if you want. So uh, definitely a lot of cool features on this camera. It's a very very simple um, point and shoot camera to use as well. If you've never had a point and shoot this is definitely one of the best ones to go for. So um, I personally I've had this camera for about a week or so and I'm loving it. Um, giving it a full 10 out of 10 uh, for a point and shoot camera right now. So um, if you're going for any point and shoot um, credit card small size camera um, as it's like a secondary camera even if you have an SLR this is definitely the best one on the market right now so um, there you have it it's Canon PowerShot ELF 300HS one of the best point and shoots you can buy right now on the market highly recommend it go check it out